Hey guys, it's Bridget. Listen, I am back with another vlog. Being 50, empty nesting, vegetarian eating, and trying to really just enjoy life with all the plants that I can stand. I just wanted to remind you that you gotta keep life simple. And that may mean finding balance with your work, especially if you're an entrepreneur like me and you have 15 projects happening at one time. And then you have to be able to know how to find the balance so that you can get out and play. Listen, we went to a to do some work in the middle of the day and got blessed with all these drinks to sample. So needless to say, that work day was a very happy occasion in the middle of the day on the Tuesday. You know, like sometimes you just have to be prepared to go with the flow and I love my job and being able to help my clients who are aspiring entrepreneurs find that exact same balance in their life and in their best practices as they start to run their business and build it. It takes a strong person to be an entrepreneur. I was talking to someone just the other day and they're like, I admire you because I don't know if I could do it. And this is a fact entrepreneurship is not for everybody. You can be an entrepreneur and still work your full-time job, which I suggest, especially if you are not really ready to dedicate the sacrifice that it takes in order to really slow down your life and give up some of the things that you used to be able to enjoy doing because now you've got to spend time making that money. You know, when you don't have that paycheck coming in and you can't be guaranteed that you're going to have your bills and all the things taken care of, you have to hustle. So being an entrepreneur or small business owner means never a day off. There's no time in between. But when you find that happy work-life balance, you're able to get out of your comfort zone, make things happen, and go where the money is. And that means spending your time wisely. So a couple of things that I usually do every single month is set my goals for the month. I need to know exactly what I did last month, what didn't happen, what did happen, and how can I make it better for this month, and then keep moving that needle forward so that as my business grows, I can grow too, right? So when you're setting goals, it's very important to just know where you are and and know where you want to go. And when you have that mindset together, you can do anything. You can dedicate your time every single day to sitting down, finding space to communicate with your clients, to set up meetings, to do all the things that you need to do in order to win every single month. And after a, my time in Tampa, I headed back home to Alabama where I'm staying until my transition is complete and I'm prepared for moving into my own space shortly. So speaking of goals, that's one of my goals is to just get my business in a space and a new living area so that I can continue to really see the world and just find the balance for myself. So back in the airport, headed back home and this flight was so early guys I had a flight that was like 6 15 in the morning so you know that means being up and out early 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 so caught an uber made it to the airport it was still dark outside but guess what it was packed there were so many people out and you know it's surprising when you get out into the world to realize that there's so much out there. There's so many things happening. And until you're able to have the space in your life to travel and do things and find the balance, because as an entrepreneur, you can work wherever most of the time, especially if you can get some good Wi-Fi, you can be anywhere even in the air, right? How crazy is that? So I was able to catch this flight. It was dark, but when I made my way home, the sun was shining and I'll let you enjoy this quick little episode of The Sunrise.
Thanks so much for tuning in to this episode. Listen, I am working on some really great stuff for the next couple of weeks. I hope that you will subscribe to my channel and continue to tune in every single week. Until then, keep life simple and go be great.